Annyeonghaseyo! Hi everyone, this is Arielle, one half of Soju for Two, and this is a watching now of a Taiwanese drama, Fabulous Boys, which is a remake of the Korean drama, You're Beautiful. There's also a Japanese version. Um, I think there might have been two Japanese versions, I'm not sure, but this is the Taiwanese version, and I have to say, already watching this, I like it better than the Korean one. Now, I love Jung Gun Suk, so I clearly love the, the Korean one, and it's definitely in one of our top, it's in all of our top lists, but I can already tell I like Kira Wong as this character better than I like Jung Gun Suk. Um, just because, I mean, I like Jung Gun Suk once he turns around, but like right now when he's still mean, Kira Wong is so good. Um, so I guess I'll just tell you the, the two mains, and there's obviously the four guys from Angel. I can tell you already, I don't care about the other two guys. I mean, they're cute, they're gonna, we're gonna love them, but it's gonna be Hira Wong. Um, so if Hira Wong plays Taekling, and Cheng Yu Ji plays Gao Mei, Mei Gu, I think I wrote it wrong, but it's supposed to be like Gomi Nam. Um, they just sort of changed the Gao oh, Mei Nu, that's what it is. Um, yeah, Gao Mei Nu instead of Gomi Nam. Um, so this drama is, the plot is the same. You have a girl who's subbing for her twin brother, um, pretending to be a boy. It's a cross-dresser. It's a musical cross-dresser. She becomes part of a band, Angel. Um, and the music is all the same from the Korean drama, so we love that. We love those songs to begin with. Um, and basically, Hero Wong's character is a jerk. He hates life. Um, he doesn't know if she's a boy yet. He's going to find that out. We all know what's going to happen. But he is really good in this so far. Like I, he doesn't make the crazy pout faces that we had with Jung Sook, so I already love him because it's like a little less crazy than Jung Sook. Even though we love Jung Sook's crazy, you know, we totally were on the boat with that. But I love him. Um, he was in Absolute Boyfriend, the Taiwanese version. He was in Momo Love. Um, he was in other things I can't think of right now. But he's uh, adorable and really, really lovable. So I can't wait to see this. The Korean actress was in this for like a five seconds in the beginning. She sort of did a little cameo. Um, and we loved her in that. But I honestly thought that she always looked like... She looked a little bit feminine, but she actually played the masculine thing pretty well most of the time. Um, especially because she has like the dimpled chin, things like that. But this girl clearly looks like a girl. But it's okay, because I think it is cute. The whole androgynous thing, it works. Um, so we can believe it for the moment. And I think a lot of things in power of suggestion. Like, if someone says it's a girl, then maybe you believe it. I mean, it's a guy. But clearly she's a girl. Um, and then, so we have the side characters that are obviously going to fall in love with her. I think everyone's going to fall in love with her, frankly. Um, and there's some, like, cute other actors in this that were, like, singers that were adorable in the first episode. So, it's going to be great. We know we're going to love it. Um, the misunderstandings, we know what they're, when they're coming. Um, we're gonna have a lot of them. Basically all about her gender most of the time. Um, bad guy turned good. Clearly, Hero Wong's character is going to be the bad guy. But we love him, and he's gonna turn really, really good. So we're happy about that. Um, Kiss. So the Kiss is the thing that's happening in episode 2. I didn't watch episode 2 even though it's up yet because it's not subbed, um, but I'm pretty sure that's what happened in the first one. It seems to be following the Korean plot exactly, so it should be pretty good. Um, we shouldn't have too much of a problem there. Um, piggyback ride, not in this one. She threw up in his hand. That's pretty close to a piggyback ride, I would say. We're almost there. Um, but maybe when the drunken taking her home, there might be a piggyback ride there. There will definitely be a, dead a deadlift. That's how we know the second guy loves her um, because he picks her up and he realizes by looking at her eyelashes that she's a woman. Because your eyelashes give it away. Um, fashion, it's great fashion, super flower boy. It's probably one of the best Taiwanese fashions, uh, dramas I've seen yet. It looks a lot like the Korean, so it's really good. A lot of times Taiwanese dramas don't have that fashion appeal that you have with Korean dramas, but this one seems to be pretty good. Plus, Hero Wong's in it. I love him, so he's fashionable. Um, music, it's, yeah, it's the music from the Korean drama. So, basically, you need to watch it. If you love the Korean drama, I think you're going to love this one. You might even like it a little bit more. I feel like already, I think it's a little less campy than the Korean ones. I'm already going to love it more, even though I already love the Korean ones. So, it can't go wrong. Um, and definitely watch it. I, the only thing I wish is it was sub faster, but thank you to everyone that subs it anyway. That's really hard, I know. But please sub it faster. We really, really want to see it. So... <laughs> That's it. I will definitely keep you guys posted on it, and I love it, so bye, guys.